How's it going everybody? My name is Apples and welcome to a brand new video where I'm gonna be a little bit monotone this video just because I recently got my wisdom teeth removed and uh, that is very hurt me. Apologies, but hopefully you're still gonna appreciate the video. So in this video I got you some uh, changing of a crystals for me. I changed completely to PvP crystals or technically human damage crystals. And the reason why I did it is because now the human damage crystals will affect where I grind aka the Brigadini Den and also Bloody Monastery because they are humans. And also I officially now am 100 hours in mantrams or the mantra for the mana piece for the last mana piece and I stopped grinding there. At least as massive as I did, so now I can go Hadoom spots and also for those who are saying I promised 104 hours, I did 5 hours and Finnels. Finnels was the extra mana piece spot for the Mantrums as a replacement. So as a celebration I went for another uh, hour at Rodros and also extra hour in Prouty Cave and I actually managed to get myself a Spectre's Energy. I don't need them anymore, I think I have like 4 in total so... I don't know game. So I went to my second favorite place. It is Brigadini Den for the yellow pieces so I can so I can get an upgrade to my obsidian gear or the black star gear to make it obsidian. And you will see in this video the obsidian gear. Or you know what? Let's just get into it right now. So to create obsidian specters energy, I first of all needed to create Passion of Voltara, which is basically just 100 Voltara's flame and 100 Garmoth scales. Pretty easy. Uh, you gotta grind the orcs, the also the three man castle rotation in Hadoom servers. So for reasons of Akiara, I needed to get Akiara tied, grinding imps, the duo spot, or chunks, I think, in the swamp. And also I will need to get a hundred oil voids, basically five different potions or oils, my bad. Then courage of Nark, I needed to get a hundred Narks lightning, that is the uh, Brigadine then. I think Bloody Monastery, if I'm not mistaken. And also I'll need to get 10 fragments of creations. I just simple alchemy, just regular accessories like Forest Ranrod. Uh, Legacy of Ancient is the second or the third product. I just needed to uh, heat one of the crystal from Dragon. I melted the Gervishes because they're min listed. And for the last one, I needed to get Flower of Madness, which is the most expensive one which is 100 seed of voids and also 10 of concentrated boss auras. So combining all of these five pieces gets you also, yeah, including the specter's energy at the last, gets you the obsidian specter's energy. So then you choose whatever um, that accessory you want, or that accessory, that um, black star piece you want. I chose the helmet and uh, I just put it in. And it gets you 4 DP, 4 evasion, and 4 DHP. And I recently found out that at the pen level of a black star, it actually doesn't give anything, which is kind of sad. Hopefully they change that in the future, but they don't really like to rework stuff. So I think we're just not ever going to hit a pen black star unless they release falling gut stuff. Technically then the obsidian upgrade is throwing away money because you can't decraft all of the materials that you spent. So this is my first hour without the crystals in the Brigandini Den. I don't know if this clip can tell you that how much damage I deal because I'm not doing the same combo but for my first reaction I annihilated everybody. Holy shit you can notice the difference. <laughs> the human damage is noticeable. And obviously because it's my stream, I went for some accessory enhancing and I got myself a duo Tongrad belt and then I tapped it to try, which uh, then funded all of the crystal buying because crystal, human crystals are very, very expensive. And then also I did one hour in orcs just because I wanted the obsidian upgrade, which I needed. So I grinded there. So what is the next plan on streaming wise and gear wise? Well, uh, the next stream that I will do, it's either going to be the dices plus enhancing the eye of the ruin rings because i've been buying them out um uh, i've been buying them out and i have now 100 eye of the ruin rings hopefully this 100 will make me a a tech because i do have the stacks not all of them also i need to maybe buy out some um plus 18s and plus 40s or the next stream you will see, I will do the 1000 Mantra Voodoo Dolls. Maybe that's going to be first, just because that's going to provide me money instead of this would 
kill my money. Hopefully the Eye of Dorian Ring will uh, succeed. Also wanted to mention that the event currently going on with the Nuver outfit, which looks fantastic, except for Zerkers, obviously, because we still don't have a cape. The next two weeks, we're going to be having this event where you can actually obtain the Nuver outfit. And also, if you do complete it, you get this beautiful dragon. The bad thing is you need to go to get three different pieces. I am so far out of two Nuvers, got actually one of them, which is the wing. But the thing is, it's not the the drop from the Nuver is the harder part. The hardest part is actually, it is actually the Contarnius crystal, which is you need 30 times 500 million silver. So this costume will call will cost you in total 30 billion silver. I will not buy this costume. But the dragon looks cute. I would love to have that. Kind of wish I would get it, you know what I mean? What happened to my money is uh, I'm basically prepping for the enhancing, so I got a bunch of stacks on my Valkyrie. Ta-da! It's off-camera stuff that I don't want to do include because it's going to be boring but i'm in bloody monastery i'm gonna try out see what's going on maybe i can do some personal best now with these crystals and uh yeah should be should be fun oh my god this feels like butter compared to what i did uh, previously I do notice the difference, but I can't really test out the crystals just because there's too many people around. So just gonna pretend they work and it's fun and it's awesome. I need to like change my sleeping schedule so I can wake up in the middle of the night and grind without nobody disturbing or something. Yo, thank you very much for watching. Enjoy the rest of your day. Sorry for the short video, but also go clean your teeth. Take care of them. Yeah, enjoy the rest of your day. I'm gonna try to go to eat something. Um, hopefully that's going to work out <laughs> and, uh, see you tomorrow on stream.